another big one. Probably. <laughs> this is so amazing. As the sun's coming up, and there's Shattered Rock. All right, so I have to back up. I have to give you guys a little context behind this video. So this video is going to be part one of a multi-video series from myself, my good buddy Scott, and Pat Magdaleno up in the UP of Michigan chasing the epic Standard Rock lake trout. Now this video is part one because the one day we were able to get out to Standard Rock, it was the most epic day of fishing that either myself, Scott, Pat, all of us have ever seen by a lot. We caught 20 lake trout over 20 pounds. I believe three over 30 pounds too, which is just stupid. For those of you that do not know where Standard Rock is, Standard Rock is a very, very, very difficult place to get to by boat. It is about 30 to 35 miles out into the middle of Lake Superior. I believe it's a five by one mile reef. There's a big lonely lighthouse that's out there to mark for shipping vessels. On our three day trip out there, we knew we probably weren't going to get out there for all three days. We ended up only being able to get out there one day and we were very thankful for that because I believe the three weeks previously to that day, Mags had not been able to get out there one single day because of the winds. It was absolutely insane and a blessing that we were able to get out there. But before that epic day in Sand Rock Lake Trout, the first day we trolled inshore for the Lakers and usually inshore fishing, you're not going to get that large a fish. But then this happened. Yeah, it's trying to reel all the way to that uh, wall. This is where fish are off. Oh, that hook is not <laughs> far in there. On by one hook. <laughs> oh, no. oh god, one little tiny one travel little zone. Hook, dude. If he snaps his head, he's gone. I got the weight. I got the weight. Ah, there's, yeah. there's a big fish right there, too. That's a nice one. The oh god, get this Wow. Dude, this, this one's, one's heavy. Out. Hook came out. That Woo! is a big one, dude. Hey, hold this camera for a second. So as Max, hold this remote. This is hectic right now. Absolutely hectic. Oh god, this is heavy. That's a big fish. Don't thumb it, just let him oh, go. God. Wow. What is that, Max? 13? That's a little more. Yeah, like probably 15. 14 pounds. Yeah, dude. This thing is just solid taking. It's like I'm snagged. Well, this fish like has made a beeline right at us. Literally just went from 200 to dude, right at the right boat. Here. I'm at eight. What the hell? Okay, yeah. this counter's wrong. Okay, it's not 100 percent as close as we thought. Oh no, it's at 90. The 90. First, the first one's wrong. Holy shit. Holy shit. Oh yeah. Dude. Oh wow. Oh my god. This one's wow. not big enough. Shit. Wow! Oh my god! Wow! Got him! Oh. Got him! Oh my god! Oh yeah! Let's go! What a way. beast! Oh, oh my god! Dude, that's a freaking monster! Dude, Who let's has to go! go. Rock. Oh my god! That's Look at that! Pounds. We were like a mile or two from shore! In shore, in shore Lakers. Abs I got a 15. That's like a 25. Look at my foot for a comparison here. Absolute unit. Okay, so that fish, the second we hooked it for about 10 minutes, I didn't gain a foot of line, and he ripped out about 150 feet of line. We put the boat neutral, and he swam at us. Like I took up over 250 feet in like a minute. That fish helped us out big time. He just gave up after that initial he surge. Yeah. He was done. He immediately at us the whole time. I, I, I think that huge line. surge he had, he was just done. Yeah. So we have a bloody mess in the boat right now. We blasted a bunch of pictures because that was such an epic fish. I realized I needed to put a bit of them on camera because this is an inshore <laughs> lake trout of a lifetime. We're estimating it around 25, maybe a little more, 25 pounds. But it looks like a king salmon in there. It makes that 15 that I just caught look Whoa. small, and that's saying something. I mean, this is an absolutely ridiculously huge lake trout. That's the, Pat, what would you estimate this fish to be? Like, how old? I would say that's all of 25 pounds, and it's probably 30 to 35 years old. That's insane. That fish is older than all of us. Mags, a lot of people probably ask, but size that big, how many Lakers are out here, dude? And no big deal to harvest them, right? Yeah, there's tons. This lake is loaded with lake trout. When I'm jigging, I try not to kill fish like that, but when you're trolling, it's, you know, that one had it buried anyway, so. Yeah. 
We've probably marked like a thousand fish already today. Yeah. Oh yeah. Now it's you been usually, pretty crazy. Usually you take the big, risky, expensive venture 40 miles into the middle of Lake Superior to stay for Standard Rock for a chance at Lake Trout that big. But we got that like a mile or two from shore. That is epic. Epic, bro. Obviously a 30 pound inshore lake trout is a phenomenal way to start the trip. None of us could believe that the biggest one that Mags had previously seen in person in shore was 21 pounds. So we shattered that goal. Now, without further ado, let's get on to Standard Rock Lake Trout. Fish right there. Here we go, first drop. Scott's first drop, he already, yo, the lighthouse is right there. Yeah. It is an hour before sunrise and we can already see the bottom. I've already gotten like three bumps. So you're slowly jigging on the bottom. Nice, dude. Keep it right on the bottom. Oh God, I got hammered. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I know, I'm, I'm a little wrapped. Jesus. I know, dude. I've already been dumped twice. <laughs> oh! <laughs> you want to stay right on the bottom, right, Max? So. Did he hit it hard on the way up? He just hit it. Just a nice bolt. Oh, those head shakes are fucking <laughs> Dude, one head shake and roll, and I just turn the handle four times to catch up. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! No, oh, I dude, lost dude, him. Dude, dude. Slower. Big fish. I lost him. Can I stop? Drop it back down. Oh, that Check was your drag. Max. Max. So if I get a bite on the reel up like I just had, just crush him. Don't yeah. you worry about him fucking getting by him. You really do lots, lose lots of bites. Oh my god! No, are you like over six? <laughs> Dude, that was I'm such an awkward like hook set. Eight, okay. That felt like I just set into straight bottom. And it didn't hook. No. <laughs> look at the fucking screen, dude. Look middle down. Oh my god. <laughs> this is insane. Oh, Scott, you're getting wrecked. There we go. Double. Yes, on the reel up. This is also heavy. Dude, mine did not go big for like two, three, like maybe a minute, and then he just freaking. I don't think this is that big. Mine's not big. I can gain on him. I'm already at four. This is little, probably. Yeah, mine's up. Mine's little. Ooh, Mine is so colored up, dude. Really? Yeah. He's running. Scott, look at this one. Oh, yeah. Look at those colors. Dude, we gotta get some epic photos of these fish. I'm gonna put them oh, yeah. in the How close to the spawn would you say these fish are? Um, they spawn, depends on oh the water temp, but usually it's October, bubbles. November. Look at the so size of those bubbles. Dude. Mega bubbles? Oh, shit, 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 okay. Fish yeah, I don't think so. Can you stop it? This Bullshit. fish is huge. <laughs> My bad. Yes! yes! <laughs> Ooh, fuck yeah. That was such an awkward handshake. I'm half asleep yeah. still. Okay. Hold that one in the water. Sunrise? Well, not even, dude. <laughs> well, I guess, yeah. First fish for me is over 20. So 10 minutes at standing. Yeah, back. so, so good. Mags handed me a rod with a spoon. Said, reel this up, you'll get a fish, guaranteed. I started reeling, probably turned the handle five times, 20 pounds. It's so cold, dude. It's so cold. Time to get, uh, see this fish out of the water, get some good picks. and. a water cap. So those are all lake trout. They're yeah, everywhere on the, dude, they're everywhere on the, the grass. The spoon fell out. So 10 minutes on the rock. What is that, like a high teen, low 20? Yeah, he's 20. Big fins. <laughs> okay, he let his fish go, and there's about 30 on the graph, so I couldn't even wait to get down there. What? 
Oh yeah. There are so many fish down there. Dude, this is heavy. <laughs> the second you get down there, it's just immediate. <laughs> Standard Rock is a very legendary, notoriously difficult place to reach, and it is not disappointing at all. Oh, this is a nice fish too. <laughs> not huge, but it's probably 15 pounds. Oh, his fins are just white. My arms are already sore from holding that fish. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Dude, it's just as big as yours. Okay, my fish was another 20 plus pounder. Took a couple pictures. It's we'll been a very hectic, confusing start. <laughs> We've already got each got 20 pounders. This is what I am using. If any of you are curious, mine is 130 feet down, so I really don't want to show it. <laughs> oh, this, but that sun. Just a straight hook on it. Yeah, fuck it. Okay, we reset up on the spot. The sun is coming up. There are fish all over the graph. I predict the hookup. Ah, I didn't get one on the reel up. Oh, you didn't, did you? It's not very big. <laughs> oh, he came off. Yeah. Reel it away. No fucking meter again. No way. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Told you. It's almost like you know these fish. Oh yeah. That's a good Back fish. Off your drag a little yeah. Bit. And just let him dictate the whole fight, right? You were, you were up high, huh? Yeah, I was at least halfway up the water column. Probably. <laughs> this is so amazing. As the sun's coming up, and there's Standard Rock. That's good. I've been strictly reeling, and it's so fun when they hit it on the reel. <laughs> oh, God. That's a good one, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of want to stop him. You've just been peeling drag for like a couple dude. minutes. Him... Oh no, oh, yeah. Scott. <laughs> Mags is hooked up. You got a big one? Okay, I trust Mags when he says that. Let's go, triples. Oh God! Real, 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 real. Oh, he came off. Oh, mine came off. Kind of got a little. Way too loose. Way loose. Now it's too loose. Dude, we're tripled up on giants right now. I think. Do you, could this potentially be the same fish, Max? Could this be the same fish that I just fought for multiple minutes and he bit again? This is not the same fish. This is so much lighter. The one I have now. I have a big fish on. This is oh, unbelievable. Oh. You see that shakes on mine too. This is unbelievable. <laughs> Dude, when they when they head shake and spin at the same time, it that's what happened. That one. Dude, I you get so slack. Dude, when I lost mine, his tail hit the line and he gave me slack and he came off. You just—you might have just lost two 20 pounders in one cast. <laughs> Dude, he's, he has all three of our drags are just singing. This is a morning, dude. This is a morning. Finally, a trip is going well. Okay, I think mine's also big. Yours woke back up. Yeah. Dude, like, okay, I haven't moved this one now again for a long time. The second yeah, we got. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is hectic. So he had to put his rod in the rod holder to net Scott's fish. Mine is probably about 20. Okay, there goes Scott's. This is 
casual 17 pounder without a picture. <laughs> Scott, keep on that net. I'm coming up. Oh my god. Beautiful fish. Dude, this thing is gorgeous. It's freaking big. Oh my goodness. Oh. We just had like score, score, score. Here you go, dude. So, this is not a super giant. God, these fish are so hard to hold. So this fish, not a super giant, but a very beautiful colored out fish. We're gonna get him back quick. Down he goes. Get him back quick for two reasons. Number one, better survival rate. Number two, I hook more fish. Mags, explain what's going on right now. I've been fighting this fish for about 20 minutes. It's part of a triple. Oh, look at the there's bubbles. bubbles. I think it's a giant. I haven't seen him yet. <laughs> He's by himself, right? Yeah, I think so. I don't see another one. I didn't see any other fish. I can see him well. I don't see another one. Is it decent? I mean, he's not a five pounder. <laughs> so this is part of a triple up. Me and Chris's fish were both probably, what, 16, 17 pounds? Yeah. And I think Max is the big Oh, one. this one is beautiful coloring. Wow, look, look at, at the orange. orange. He's not small, dude. Oh my God, look at those orange fins. Oh, is the net out of the water? And hold the bottom of it and let it go as you net it. I pulled the bottom of the net so it doesn't get in the way. That is a very cool looking laker, dude. Yeah, that, those colorings are way better than the one I just caught. Come on. <laughs> He's working you. I'm putting some heat on him too. Four pound test, you know, going for that. What is it, IGFA? <laughs> record? Yeah. So Mags just had that fish to the surface. He is now 75 feet down. Is it often that they'll come to the surface and like go that far down even to the bottom? Yeah, sometimes, but this fight, or this fish has a little more fight than normal. He's probably 25 pounds. <laughs> okay, fish, take two. He's coming in this time. He looks pretty good. <laughs> oh yeah. Spoon. That's a pretty good one, dude. Small spoon. Small spoon. Oh, that's yeah. a pretty good one. Yeah, he's big. You got him? He's oh, really not that big. Valiant fight, though. Yeah. 20? Or more? He's probably over 20. Pretty. Clean looking. Yeah. Old entry there for maybe a lamprey. Mm-hmm. Killed lamprey over pretty good. So cool. So how old do you estimate this fish at? This so fish around like probably, 25 pounds. It's probably 30 to 35 years old, I would guess. Wow. Maybe even more. Okay, good? Good. Let's see if you take care of these fish. Release them, catch them again. See ya. Oh. Time to get a bigger one. 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 So, that was absolutely ridiculous. The video is already over 15 minutes long, and the sun is just barely creeping up over the horizon, and we've already caught multiple trophy lake trout. I don't know how many more parts of this video there's going to be. There's going to be at least two. There might even be three. I'd rather make a couple videos that are manageable to watch than one like hour long video. There's honestly that much insane footage from the day. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for the next episodes.